Welcome to a new vlog. I am mentally preparing for my first day of work this week. You guys know that the weekend is my Monday. So not prepared. Well, I survived day one. to go to work for day two. <sighs> day two is over. <laughs> I'm so glad. But tomorrow, for some reason, even though it's like my Friday on a Monday, um, yeah, it's, it's my long day. So I'm really not looking forward to it. Day three. I have to go kill this day. I just got home from work, so now I need to go in the house and eat and get to talk to Jess because I saw him for literally like five minutes and we could have just kept talking and like we couldn't or else I would have been late for work and it sucked. So, why does my nose ring always do that? So, here we are at the cardiologist's office. In my car waiting to be called in because that's what's going on today. I was almost late. You guys, I think I just made coffee for no reason because, like, I just ordered myself coffee. Well, we just went to the mall and we went shopping, which we don't really do often. It's not, like, you know, very smart to, like, go blow a bunch of money when you're saving for a house. So, I don't do that. Um, but this time we went and bought ourselves a few things that we just kind of wanted and needed. Um, I bought myself some work pants, which are already hanging up, and then I bought also some new work shoes because I looked down yesterday, I think it was, or the day before, and my toe was starting to poke out the top of my work shoes, and I was like, well, that's not very helpful, is it? Alright, so let me show you the rest of what we got. Well, what I got. We also got a Rob Zombie CD because it just came out, and... It's already sounding pretty good by what I saw. Um, I bought some bathing suit bottoms the other day and had to return them because they were way too big. I was proud to say they were too big on me because I was feeling kind of bad about myself. So um, They weren't these. I had a plain black pair because my top is plain black. And I saw these and I bought them and I just tried them on and I like them a lot. Thank God. So these are a smaller size than what I bought. And these are only, um, how much are these? They're only like 20 bucks, so not too bad if you're interested in buying those. Um, and then I've been looking at Reebok hoodies for a long time now. Reebok and Champion, and my favorite color is like Tiffany blue and teal and pink and like Oxblood red. And they had this in Tiffany, well, it is pretty much Tiffany blue. And uh, it looks green under the light on my camera, but I promise you it is. See, there we go. It is Tiffany blue. So I finally got one of these to lounge around in or wear out if I need to, if it's too cold. And then we went to the mall. And I was going to get some Birkenstocks. I went to Journeys. And the Birkenstocks. Oh my god. Bless you. Sorry. <laughs> The Bir allergies, I'm sorry. <laughs> Jeez. The Birkenstocks were $99.99, and I was like, um, hell no. I'm not paying 100 bucks for some sandals I might wear for a year or two. Um, so these are like 15 bucks, and they look just like them. And they're comfortable. I already tried them on, and they're like really squishy. So it's got like that foam stuff in them, and they're super comfortable and they fit so 
I got those and they match my bathing suit bottoms. So I'm excited about that. And let's see. For a while, I keep looking at this spa headband, and since I, for now, also work in makeup, um, I needed a spa headband, and even if I decide ever to not do it, I'll still have this for when I do my makeup, and it's Hello Kitty. I've loved Hello Kitty for a really long time, and I just kept putting it back and putting it back, and finally today, I was like, I'm just gonna buy it, so I went and got it. It's really cute and fluffy and girly, and that's what I like. And the last thing that I got was something I've had a long time ago and loved it. Well, it's not the last thing. I forgot I got something else. But um, I had this necklace, and I just started watching this old show I used to watch a long time ago. And I was, like, feeling all kinds of... What's a good word for that when you're feeling all kinds of, like... Um, when you like something that you used to like a long time ago? Nostalgic. Nostalgic about it. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to go buy another one. It really wasn't expensive. And I know I'll wear it a lot. So I wasn't really mad about it. And it's actually licensed. It's not like from Etsy, which I wouldn't have been mad about that if I would have had to. But I wanted a licensed one. And it's rhinestones. And actually, one of my friends named Stacy, my goddaughter's mother, and I became friends because we both had Playboy necklaces. So, I love this. I got it at Spencer's, in case you guys are wondering where to get these. I don't know how many people these days are into that, but since they're still selling them at the mall, I guess some people still like it. Um, so, I'm really excited I got another one, and I have earrings to match it, but I got those last January. And the last thing I got on stage, I wear um, unicorn snot glitter like on my arms and stuff, so the light will catch it. And they had um, lip gloss on sale for a buck ninety nine at Fye, so I got some of that. So that's my haul. I don't get to do hauls a lot, so I'm excited. Thank you, honey, for letting me kind of go a little crazy today. I was pretty happy about it. All right, guys, back to work tomorrow. And it's time to get ready for work again. Okay. How in the hell did yesterday go by so quickly? <sighs> Do we start over and call this day one again? Or is this day four for the week? I just got off work. I'm so tired. It was hell today. That I would never get out of there. And uh, honestly, if today was only Thursday, I really hate to see what my weekend's about to look like. I'm gonna go eat and get ready for bed and start over tomorrow. I got about four hours of sleep and today is expected to be like the busiest day at work, of course. Ugh. Ugh. Here we go again, day five for the week, and I still have tomorrow to go, and I'm all off balance because, I, like I said, I didn't sleep. Let me tell you how I feel about today. <sighs> I cried the whole way home. Sorry I didn't film anything about, like, yesterday, pretty much. I mean, I did, but I didn't. I just filmed two really silent um, clips. I was just really, really physically and emotionally drained. Sorry, I have a hair on my mouth. And um, it was not a good day for me mentally yesterday whatsoever. I hadn't slept in a couple days because my anxiety just was keeping me awake. Um, there's just a lot of catty crap going on um, that shouldn't have been going on. And I'm sick of it completely. Um, I was just exhausted from not sleeping on top of it. So Jess took me to work yesterday just because I was not 
how it's not okay at all yesterday. Um, but he went to the store and got some z -Quil and when he picked me up he took me through a drive through so nobody had to cook. So we got home, we watched one of my favorite shows, we had fast food, um, sorry that my bra's hanging up in the background, but it is what it is. I wear one at least, you know, what can I say? Anyway, um, and took some z -Quil. we both did, and a little while later we were down for the count, thank God, because I just really needed the sleep. I still feel really kind of, uh physically drained and emotionally drained today, but nothing compared to yesterday. Yesterday was pretty extreme. I still went to work. I did the best I could. I put on that fake professional thing that you just do. You do the best you can to get through it, and then I just, you know, came home and did stuff for me because I needed to, so... I'm gonna end the video now and start over and hopefully it's a better week. Bye guys.